Well, here today we have a neat little snake that really likes to live out in drier kind of areas. One of its favorite foods is lizards. It cruises around at night, poking along, looking for lizards. And it is the Texas night lizard, Texas night snake. <laughs> Definitely not night lizard. Yeah, they do like lizards. This is neat because this one's actually, I've had it for about nine years of captivity as an adult, so they live quite a long time. Another thing that's neat is they get misidentified as rattlesnakes. His look overall pattern kind of looks like a rattlesnake. And look at his little eye. Of course, he doesn't have a rattle on his tail. It kind of ruins the illusion. But if you look at the little eyes on him, see how the eye is very, very uh, vertically slit, like a lot of people assume that a venomous snake is, or have all slit eyes. This guy's completely harmless to me, but in truth, he does have a small little tooth back there that can inject, not really inject, but allow some toxic saliva to slide into the wound it makes into a lizard. Uh, they're pretty much ineffective against mammals, but to a lizard, yeah, they got a little toxin to them. I wouldn't say they're super toxic, they have a little bit. Another identifying characteristic is these little uh, dark patches right behind the neck. Most of them have that too. And you notice that big old eye with that real tight slit on it. It kind of gives you an indication that it's a nocturnal animal. These guys do definitely come out at nighttime. I uh, found them on the roads, crossing the road at nighttime. It's typically where I find them, or in rock cuts, you can find them. And the belly on them is really nice, kind of a plain color. Not much pattern to them at all. Very cool little snakes. I love them. Mm -hmm. So that's Texas night snake.